College football star facing sexual assault allegations tells his side of the story for the first time in an on-campus hearing at Florida State. If officials rule against him, he could be kicked out of school. ABC's TJ Holmes has the story. This morning, Florida State quarterback Jameis Winston shared his side of the story for the first time in the alleged sexual assault scandal that's put his college career in jeopardy. Winston saying, quote, I did not rape or sexually assault the accuser. The accuser had the capacity to consent to having sex with me, and she repeatedly did so by her conduct and her verbal expressions. The comments part of a five-page written statement Winston read during his student conduct code hearing, which ended Wednesday. In it, he goes into detail about his interactions with his accuser in 2012, first at a Tallahassee nightclub, then later at his apartment, though he declined to answer any questions about the episode. I think it's significant because it's the first time Jameis Winston has told his side of the story. Winston also also struck back at his accuser saying the only thing as vicious as rape is falsely accusing someone of rape. The accuser and her lawyer's public campaign to vilify me guarantees that her false allegations will follow me for the rest of my life. The unnamed woman also testified during the two-day hearing. We want her to be found responsible and we want her to expel from the school. I think knowing the facts of the case and what has been presented, I think there's a very, very good chance of that happening. A decision in the case is expected in two to three weeks. For Good Morning America, T.J. Holmes, ABC News, New York.